Yeah, so this is the cactus whose fruit we had in that ice cream. That's pretty, isn't that pretty? Yes, it's still flowering. Yeah. This is the Usury Mountain Recreation Park in Mesa. It looks like the fruit of it. We are in the desert. So I think a park here is where they get a section of the desert and then they um, have a sort of well-worn path and then occasionally put a bench in the middle of it. Oh, there's red flowers. So we're walking in what looks like a riverbed. Is this what the desert's like? I mean, is this... Um, it, have you just put a big sort of circle around the desert and said, here, here you go, here's a park? That's a great, that's actually a very good question. Uh, if you're talking the Sonoran Desert, mm. yes. There are four deserts in North America. Okay. And this is the Sonoran Desert of Southern Arizona and Northern Mexico. Right. And this is fairly typical of what you would see yeah. throughout large areas of the Sonoran Desert. However, to get a little technical, there are five subdivisions of the Sonoran Desert. Let's see, three of them are in uh, Mexico, okay. and two of them are in the United States. This is known as the Upland Sonoran Subdivision. Well. So it tends to be a little wetter, a little bit more biotic as far as plant and an animal species. Okay. When you get down toward Phoenix and west yeah. of Phoenix, you get into a hotter, lower, drier area where you don't see the biodiversity of plants like you do up here, where we're a little higher, a little wetter. So that's why it's a more barren look when you get into the city parks in Phoenix and west of Phoenix. Right, so what's Papago Park? Is that Papago a... Park is part of the city of Phoenix parks, and oh. that's a more barren, dry environment there. Yeah. But for the upland Sonoran subdivision, uh, this is typical. Okay. Yeah. Great question. Yeah. I know it blows people away because their stereotypical image of the desert is like Lawrence of Arabia, you know, more like the Saudi or yeah. Saharan desert. Sand desert. That, yes. that was my exactly. um, idea of a desert. Mm -hmm. but this, this has some life in it. Oh, it's yes. Just, it's just dry. <laughs> it is. You know, the 20 major, major deserts of the world, the Sonoran Desert, our desert, is the most biodiverse, more different yeah. species of plants and animals than any of the 19 other deserts. Oh, okay. so, We yeah. live in the luscious desert we do. in the world. Yeah, right here. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Yeah. Is, that, is that like... That is a great horned owl, right. which is uh, the largest owl in the state of Arizona. Wow. We have them here in our park. There's another little owl in the corner over there that lives, they live inside some of the uh, saguaro boots. Oh, yeah. Holes in the saguaros made by the woodpeckers. Right. So the woodpeckers make the holes and the owls live in them. Uh, exactly. That's yeah. a, and other birds. Yeah. Well, the, the woodpeckers do live in them for a period of time, and then when they vacate, the uh, other birds move in, like owls and starlings and kestrels.